able to see the volt see the fan running so fine so aluminum air battery with the three cells in series gives you nearly 3.5 volt and amperes is more than 300 to 400 milliamperes okay friends this will be our construction detail with regard to aluminum air battery small double a size three cells in series connection it will give 3.5 to 4 volt continuous and current around 300 to 400 milliamperes the details we'll see in our this is no aluminum air battery this design we will be needing like this six pvc small cut tubes each will be around uh, 5 cm if i am right 5 cm and one inner cap is there we will put the inner cap and make the bottom closed similarly i have prepared fashion so insert this aluminum electrode as negative i have taken an aluminum sheet 5 cm right and 6 cm length i cut like this and already i made design like this so this are all i have to keep it ready then to inserting in on the center as a positive electrode carbon i am taking as the electrode here this time carbon so to fill the i mean carbon black i have taken a nylon filter i have sealed it like a bag and i will be inserting this so in the gap i am going to fill the carbon black and make this as the positive electrode this will be our with regard to this positive electrode now i have taken this carbon rods you can see this carbon rod now those bags which i showed you know in the nylon bags i have put inserted this carbon rod into that then carefully i have filled this carbon black powder into that only carbon black powder so after filling slowly you tighten like this so similarly i prepared six electrodes or able to see so that i can make insert uh, in individual cells this i inserted so after inserting before that i will put some filter cloth so that it should not touch each other those electrodes should not touch each other so there's a gap no in that gap we will be filling this uh, electrolyte that is 2n sodium hydroxide and after that no to just make it a proper cell i have made a cap again what i used in the bottom cap, inner cap no same cap i have made a hole here so that this positive electrode will get inserted so another one gap i have created so it will nicely fit like this so this are all i have made it in advance to these individual cells no so i inserted this aluminum sheet which is a negative electrode for us to prepare the aluminum wire battery so i just inserted it completely you are able to see that at the bottom i have placed one small piece of this filter just to protect from any damage that's all then what i'll do next is i'll take one of the electrode one of the electrode then wrap with the mask paper whatever we are using as mask no same we are just like this see that bottom also is covered with the filter papers the slowly just rotate loosely loosely rotated so i rotated then i'll insert this into this okay friend no insert it then i'll put a cap then i'll fill with the electrolyte what electrolyte 2n sodium hydroxide that will be the electrolyte once you fill this with electrolyte you can see the current develop this is what the single cell this similarly i am going to do for all the other five cells that i will show you so finally you can see how i assembled this i i showed you no know, single cells all that i assembled in series now so three cells in series another three cells in series you are able to see negative positive to negative on positive to negative this two positives on the other parallel sides i have taken as one positive similarly this negative i have clipped together and made as negative so uh, actually this is three cells in series and another three cell series both are linked together so we'll see what is the output still now i have not added any electrolyte that is 2n sodium hydroxide i have not added 
and see what is the volt. There won't be, there should not be any volt. Just for your verification, I'm showing you. So no volt is there. No volt is there. Able to see? No volt is there. This is through, because of the content of the hand. No, it is showing it. Now we'll start adding the electrolyte. We'll see what will be the generated volt. Okay. I'll start adding. This will be our electrolyte, 2N sodium hydroxide. How to prepare? You have to take 8 grams of sodium hydroxide dissolved in 100 ml of distilled water. 2N sodium. I will add. For each cell, I will be adding roughly. These are all I am doing in presence of you. I am also learning from you. Every experiment gives me a, a learning for me. So, 6 ml I am adding. Through this, I am able to see. I am injecting slowly. Because there is no air gap, no, that is why it takes time. It is filled up so fast. Slowly at that. If it is open container, it will be easily. This is consumed better. If it is a open vessel, I mean cells, no, you can freely add. Since we have closed it, I have to slowly inject. All experience only. Once you do, no, you will be still doing better. This is my experience. You can still do better. So again, we will be adding it. Okay. Even the first one you can add it. Because there is no air, it is bubbling out. We will see what is the volt generated. We will connect the positive and the negative. This is the positive one. This will be the negative one. Able to see the volt getting increased now. Actually, three cells are there connected. No, each cell gives you 1.3. So, when you connect three cells in series, it should be around 3.9 or 4. See the voltage. Okay, nearly 4.26. It's able to give 4.26 volt. Okay, then we'll see what is the ampere it is able to give out. I have put in 250 milliamps reading. You can see the voltage above 250 milliamps. Above 250 milliamps. So I am going to change the from 10, 10 amps I am going to put it. So, we will see what is the so nearly 400 milliamps it is able to give at short get you reduced. So, 300 to 400 milliamps output is there ok friends we will see what is the how the motor runs using this battery. Able to see friends, it's beautifully the motor runs beautifully. Able to see, it runs beautifully. Able to see the volt, see the fan running so fine. So, aluminum air battery with it. 3 cells in series gives you nearly 3.5 volt and amperes is more than 300 to 400 milliamperes. Okay friends, if you like kindly 
I mean press the like button comments you can do you can please subscribe it makes me do still better modified cells for you thank you